वेलकम बैक टू द लाइफ ऑफ हलिक चैनल एंड टूडेज टॉपिक इज गोइंग टू बी अबाउट सिंप्लीफाइंग माई लाइफ नाउ आई वॉज वॉचिंग अ वीडियो वेयर दानदपनी अर ग्रेट स्पिरिचुअल लीडर वॉज गेटिंग इन इंटरव्यूड एंड कपल ऑफ लर्निंग्स दैट आई हैव टेकन फ्रॉम हिम मेड मी रियलाइज दैट आई हैव रियली कॉम्प्लिकेटेड माई लाइफ इन सो मेनी वेज राइट सो टूडे आई वॉज द होल डे आई हैव बीन स्पेंडिंग अबाउट यू नो simplifying my life and trying to do those things that create the maximum in- impact and uh, the interview of brian was asking such beautiful questions to him to get to know what are those things that uh, monks like dandapani or spiritual leaders like him do daily that helps them keep their life simple and much more effective right so one of the key learnings that i got from him was that we have a finite amount of energy and we cannot just give away that energy in doing a lot of you know things that are not uh, yielding in a happy life for you right so that's one of the key things that i found the you know finite energy that i have apart from that uh, he has a ritual dandapani has a ritual where he you know simplifies his life every year uh, trying to reduce the number of people in his life and the number of activities that ha- he can do right so to all of those things now the first part of uh, almost taken care where i am able to reduce the number of uh, people in my life and um, do the things that i like but apparently i am doing a lot of activities so the first activity that dandapani told was that you know we don't really spend a lot of time with ourselves thinking and you know debating about the larger things in our life that we ought to take care right so that's what i did today uh, i've been always doing it in from the past one year but not that it, it was not that effective uh, and i didn't know how to do it properly so dandapani showed me the way to do it properly and i sort of sat down today and then wrote down all the things that were impacting me right so things like you know what is the one thing that matters most for the next 6 months right i'm not going to tell more more details about that because i'm still contemplating on those things i'm still writing down what need to stay and what i need to do and what i did not do right so the first four activities that i felt i should be doing and uh, you know simplifying my life on these areas at least that's where i'm really confident so my learning continues from linda.com yoga and hiit continues um, you need to be physically fit that's one of the thing mentions uh, i have anywhere you go that's one of the things that needs to be done meditation and mindfulness now this is one new learning that i got uh, apparently the things that you do in your day to day life that is you know in most of your waking hours impact how you do your meditation and then how you do your meditation sort of impacts your life in a more positive way right so it's a it's a circle it's not the other way around where you meditate and then expect your thing life to be much more uh, happier and easier right it's not the it's not that way it's the way you do each and every activity that impacts your meditation and then that meditation sort of uh, helps you impact all of other other things in your life right so that's one of the learnings i got from him uh, meditation has really improved what how i think or how i make decisions how i speak a confident i am about myself uh, however i felt some thing that was missing and dandapani sort of cleared it obviously i'm not saying that i have learned whatever i needed to from dandapani on meditation i have still more to learn I cannot be arrogant about it but it solved one puzzle that i have been seeking right so now that i know uh, one of the things that i'm going to do is not just meditation it's going to be also mindfulness now what does mindfulness mean it's basically starting and completing each task and not leaving it in 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 between so one of the things that is most simplest thing that you can do is obviously 
making your uh, bed every day right so that's my bed there i don't leave my bed uh, unattended unorganized every now every morning so that's one of the things that i've already taken care the second thing is uh, shifting your focus from different activities right so finish things like if you start one activity finish it to the end and see it ends right so you have a target uh, may, may it can be a targeted time uh, a task a targeted task whatever it may be right so complete the task even if it is like eating food right so you eat food take the vessels completely wash it and then uh, put it for dry right so at least that's a completion of activities now these are all simple activities nothing mumbo jumbo but you know they have a profound impact on how you do your day to day activities you know carefully and just focusing on that activity uh, a simple activity another activity can be if you're speaking to somebody um somebody in front of you ensure that your mobile is kept away and you're giving the full attention that you're that you need to give to that particular person uh, when you're speaking about that activity so, right so that's one of the things that i learned i'm going to apply that um, meditation is not just going to be like a 20 minute thing Uh, for me every day it's just going to be every day i'm going to practice whichever activity i'm doing i ensure that i give my full attention and focus to that particular activity then um, obviously i have been reading a lot of books but they were not focused to the endeavors that i'm taking uh, up right now and that is around my passive income how can i generate a passive income right so i'm going to read the books relevant to how i can generate a passive income and uh, move full force into generating a passive income for myself right and then obviously i wanted to practice keyboard daily but um, you know we have a limited time since i'm working uh, i have exercise meditation uh, and those activities are primary for how i make decisions and how i run my life and uh, i the interest in keyboard is definitely there it's not gone but right now if i had to choose between activities obviously it is the passive income that i want to generate now if once that is on track then i can come back to practicing keyboard daily but until then i have to ensure that my energy is focused just on creating the passive income now keyboard is one thing that i will play weekly i don't want to lose a continuity probably weekends i will spend one hour on it and ensure that i'm practicing uh, keeping the practices not really learning the songs and all that thing but keeping the practice working right so these are the, these are these are my thoughts guys um uh, how this is going to pan out for me i don't know uh, obviously it will be all i will only know when i have applied it for a month to a month or a three month period right so that's 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 my strategy guys uh for this but from now on till six months from now um and hoping you know i am uh, i should give a positive uh, i i should be able to you know, i i am already generating a good amount of passive income from the activities that i've begging today and um towards the end of six months i should be able to confidently be making a good amount of passive income right um so hope you have learned uh, a lot from this video a lot of or little whatever it is um and you know i'm documenting this journey so that you come out to know how and how how and uh, how i think uh, how i make the decisions to lead my life right so if you've learned something from this video and are applying it in your life please do mention that into the comment section it will help me gauge my understanding and put out content uh, in a much more engaging way so that you get wa- what you want to do right and if you like this video please hit the thumbs up button it means a lot for me and uh, while you are finishing this video don't uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and uh, thank you uh, enjoy your sunday night